Jesus, God. Saka coming from my place to your place. Anyways, I have this mask. I've been carving on uh, Celebrity Solstice uh, cruise ship. And I've got it pretty much. Um, I'm going to do some more carving on the front. But right now, I'm lightening it up. And what I've been doing is... is uh, Taking uh, taking this area down because I have the forehead that has quite a bit of space. I have the lower lip that has quite a bit of space. So, as you, so I'm taking it down, dropping the sides in, thinning it up, and it's actually lost quite a bit of weight, as you say. And so I'm gonna take um, I'm gonna go ahead and put my glasses on. I've got a knife that, I, that I've made and so what I'm doing right now is I'm just cutting that area out, lightening it up the back. So I've been doing this since I got home a couple of days ago. Um, it's all good between that and then catching up on the yard work and everything. Um, works out okay. So anyways, I'm, I'm happy with the progress I'm making here. Uh, got some cedar bark here that I'm going to get pounded out. Uh, sometime probably this week in a couple of days. Doesn't matter when I do it. Just as long as I have it done before June 23rd. So now I'm going to come over here a little bit on this side and see about taking it down a little bit more beautiful weather but I, I like having this cool air though Like I said, this area here is the area that's in alignment with this right in here, coming down. That's the area I'm working on back here. And this part here, I can use this like, I'm gonna try it with this one. See, so yeah, I work kind of with the grain. And I do spray it though too. Introduce a little water, soften up some fibers. So you get the idea. That's a pretty good bag of chips that I last couple of days. Bag of uh, cedar chips that came out of the back of this one here. Like I've mentioned before, these hand grains are the hardest areas to carve on any piece of wood that I carve with anyway. That's just the nature of uh, wood.
Hope everybody's enjoying their Memorial Day weekend. So I'll take this down a little bit more and then kind of show you. Anyways, this knife that I'm using is a hollow ground in the bottom. Which is preferred by some artists and some others it doesn't matter as much. It's just a matter of what your preference is. Hollow ground means it's kind of rounded cupped on the bottom. So you're just sharpening the very 1 8 inch on either side or less. And it also depends on what your sharpening system is that you use too. So, put my knife back here. Drop that a little bit. Gives you a little bit of an idea. I'm pushing this down and pushing this down. Then I'll thin these up. Once I get it pushed down and get it lightened up to where I like it, because it, it doesn't need to be there, because we have all this wood that's here. So like I said, when I, when I get it pushed down to where it gets even lighter, then I'll go ahead and continue working on the front. So anyways, have a great day. Yeah, quite the team. Saw it soon.